Tia Walker. We're backstage at Hervé Leger, Fall 2011, and we are about to talk to one of the models that'll be walking in the show this afternoon. Like, can you tell me your name? Zuzu. And how old are you? 19. And what agency are you with? New York Models. And what country are you from? Ukraine. Are you excited about the show? I'm very excited about Did it. Did you happen to walk in any of his other shows, perhaps? Yeah, I opened the CBG. And uh, I did Max Azria, so today is Hair Ledger. I'm really excited about it. We're still backstage at Hervé Leger, Fall 2011, and we are on the red carpet awaiting the celebrities to come onto the stage, the step and repeat as you, as you will, uh, and get a few questions in. So, right this way. Third show of the season. The season began with BCBG on day one. A few days later, we had Max Azria and now Hervé Leger to close out his trio of fall 2011 collections. We're right on the carpet of Hervé Leger with Heather Marks. Heather, tell me what brings you to the show today. I just came here to watch. I'm a huge fan and I love the clothes and wear them a lot, so wanted to come check out the new collection. I love the dress on you, how does it feel? Thank you. I feel great in it. It's a fun color, it's a little different than I kind of usually do, but yeah. Very, very nice. We look forward to seeing you out front in the front row. Thank you. Thank you. Beautiful Lila Zark of the Miss Shapes. I know that you come to Max Azria quite often. Tell us a little bit about your past with Max and about the dress today, if you can. I am a big fan of Max Azria. I think he's wonderful and he does amazing collections for every kind of woman, be it the BCBG or his own collection or Hervé. They just, something for every woman, every type of woman. <laughs> and the dress today, did you pick this out or did they have it sent to you? Oh no, I picked it out. I pick out all of my clothes. I'm not just letting somebody send me things, no. <laughs> Do you um, wear Max Asby or Hervé Leger, BCBG when you spin? I'm often in an Hervé dress when I'm DJing. I have several that are my go-to little black dresses. That was Lee Lazark of the Miss Shapes. We're still backstage at Hervé Leger, fall 2011, and we're going to sign off and head out front to um, front of house. Mercedes-Benz Fashion Week. We're in the tent lobby and we've got a hold of Robert Verdi, fashion I, style expert. I was Twittering. You got me in the middle of my he's Twitter. Tweeting, he's tweeting. He's tweeting here in the lobby. So my question here for you is yeah. how has your Fashion Week been? We're almost finished. We've only got a few days left. 
Uh, tell us how your fashion week has been and what you're looking forward to, if anything, because everything has probably already happened. It's A lot has happened, but one thing hasn't happened, I'll let you know, Tia, you know this, that the <laughs> big thing happening this week is Michael Kors' 30th anniversary. Yes. Yeah. So that is something that's coming up that I'm really looking forward to. Um, and I think the thing that really excites me are these emerging talents, and I work with the Equity Money Fashion Foundation, and I am always incredibly impressed at how much talent there is in the U.S. and how many interesting original thinkers we have in the landscape of fashion. So I was really happy. I just saw Bibu Moapatrisha, who won the Eka Damani Award for Women's Wear this year. Yeah. Um, and I loved seeing it because I dress so many girls on the red carpet that I like seeing collections that are evening wear focused or cocktail dress focused, and his is. So I loved seeing that. Well, you heard it here first. He's Robert Verdi, fashion style expert. Thank you so much. No Enjoy the rest of your fashion Thank week. You. We're going to take a look around uh, the tent lobby here, see what else is going on, see some of the sponsors for uh, Mercedes Benz Fashion Week, and we'll talk to you shortly. And we're back. We're at the Kim Crawford Wine Bar inside of Mercedes Benz Fashion Week 2011, Fall 2011, tent lobby. And um, you can see patrons, industry insiders, celebrities, and everyone else and their friends that love them are enjoying Kim Crawford wines. They're serving, um, not sure what they're serving. Let's see if we can find out. What are you serving today? We are serving a 2010 Sauvignon Blanc from the Kim Crawford Winery. It's from New Zealand, as well as a 2008 Pinot Noir from Kim Crawford also. We're here at the Kim Crawford Wine Bar with the VP of Marketing, Kim, Kate McManus. What brought Kim Crawford wines here this season, and what is it that you're featuring today? We are serving the Kim Crawford Sauvignon Blanc and Pinot Noir. Uh, these wines are from New Zealand, and it has a history from the founding family, Kim and Erica Crawford, of always kind of doing things outside of the box, being all about style and uniqueness and individuality. So we felt like it would be a really great opportunity for us to exert our individuality and to show everyone the style of our New Zealand wines here at Fashion Week. Thank you.